Welcome to part two of A Year Through the Seasons in the Keweenaw. In part two, we're going to explore the months from July through December. We will talk about the influence of Lake Superior and how it tempers the weather in the Keweenaw. I'm Lisa and we live in the Keweenaw, a peninsula in the northernmost part of the UP of Michigan. July is a true celebration of summer's embrace. The temperature during July is very moderate. The average temperature during the day is 80 degrees and the average temperature during the night is a very comfortable 60 degrees. Why are these temperatures so moderate, you might ask? Let me explain. Lake Superior acts as a climate buffer for the Keweenaw during the summer and winter as well. In the summer, we call it nature's air conditioning. Due to Lake Superior's large volume and depth, it stays cold year round. As a result, the air above the lake stays cooler, bringing that much cooler air to shore. This cooler air significantly reduces the daytime temperatures, making the summers in the Keweenaw very enjoyable. Okay. By mid-July, the surface of the water is approximately 55 to 60 degrees. The water temperature below 660 feet almost always remains in the low 40s. It is recommended if out on the water in a boat you should wear a U.S. Coast Guard approved life jacket because survival time without one is less than two hours. The shore of Lake Superior is a perfect place to experience the sunset and the northern lights. By July, the vast wilderness has transformed into a thick, lush tapestry of greens. Our little forest is home to a variety of wildlife who find refuge from the summer heat under the lush canopy the trees provide. The forest is now fully awake. The wildlife is abundant during this time We are so grateful to live in a place where we get a chance to catch glimpses of the wildlife in their natural habitat. The natural beauty combined with the chance to connect with nature makes July in the Keweenaw a truly remarkable experience. The month of August, often seen as the peak of summer, brings with it long, warm days. The fresh air coming off Lake Superior is often regarded as some of the purest air in the world. There are several reasons for this, such as very low pollution, the surrounding forests, weather patterns, regulatory measures, and the lake itself acts as a natural filter.
whether it's hiking the rugged shores of Lake Superior, strolling the sandy beaches, or exploring the vast wilderness, one can't help but love this beautiful land in the Keweenaw. August holds a unique balance. While we are still enjoying the warm and sunny days of summer, there is a whisper of crisp days to come. These subtle signs reminding us that fall is coming, it definitely inspires us to enjoy what's left of summer. It feels like once the transformation has started, it goes so fast. How it sways in the sun. When September arrives, the mornings shift dramatically. The early hours are now dark with a peaceful quietness that seem to blanket our world. Those bright summer mornings, alive with the cheerful chirping of birds and the warmth of the sun, feels like a distant memory. The vibrant green summer foliage starts to give way to the stunning array of fall colors. As the trees begin to change, the hills and valleys of the Keweenaw transform into a patchwork of reds, oranges, and yellows. This is just the beginning of the seasonal magic that happens here in the Keweenaw. The transition from summer to fall for us is not just a change in scenery, it's also a shift in the mood. I just love the cozy and dark season, the soft lights and a coffee or a cappuccino. I get really excited for this time of year. October is when the magic happens. All month long, the transformations are incredible and nature is changing every day. This is when autumn settles in and the landscape transforms into a vibrant tapestry of color. To be honest, I had a really hard time choosing video clips from October. October has so much beauty and there are so many different transformations. The maple trees take the lead with a brilliant display of colors. These vibrant colors create a stunning canopy that can take your breath away. Walking through a Keweenaw forest during this time of year feels like you are stepping into a painting. Each bend in the trail reveals new vistas where the colors dance against the backdrop of a clear blue sky. crisp autumn air is filled with the earthy scent of the fallen leaves, inviting you to breathe deeply and savor the moment.
landscape transforms into a picturesque scene that attracts many visitors from all over. This year again, the UP of Michigan has been awarded by USA Today Best Fall Foliage Destination for 2024. I sure wish we had smell-o-vision right now. The smell of the fresh air and the fallen leaves. Oh, it smells so good. If I could explain the smell of the fallen leaves, it would be a sweet brown sugar smell, kind of with the smell of apples in the air, ripe apples, and the smell of sweet brown sugar. How come the sky sometimes hides behind the clouds? Maybe it's just like me, a little bit scared of heights. Why does the rain always keep on pouring down when it's gray outside? me wonder yeah it makes me wonder it really makes me wonder Ooh, I wonder how come the trees get undressed when it's cold and don't they miss the leaves they left behind could it be to make the ground shine like cold until winter comes? Until winter comes? Until winter comes? It really makes me wonder. Look at the sky. Yeah, it makes me wonder. Kiwanaw is an unforgettable place to be during October as the trees burst with color and fall to the ground. October is a time of beauty and reflection as we prepare for the winter months ahead. The feeling of cozying up in our home, enjoying warm drinks, and the anticipation of the upcoming months of November and December creates a unique charm that defines life in the northernmost part of Michigan. In October, the weather can be unpredictable. With the much cooler temperatures, there's wind, occasional rain, and early snow. And Lake Superior plays a significant role in the shaping of the weather in the Keweenaw. November is a transitional month, marking the shift from fall to winter. The landscape undergoes a dramatic change as the temperatures drop. The first significant accumulation of snow usually happens in November. Living here during November means we get to experience the beauty of the season, with the vibrant autumn colors giving way to a stark, serene winter palette. The gales of November in the Keweenaw Peninsula are a well-known phenomenon. These fierce storms typically occur during late fall, when the cold Arctic air collides with the relatively warm waters of Lake Superior.
This clash creates powerful winds, often exceeding 50 miles per hour, which can lead to dramatic weather conditions. The gales significantly impact Lake Superior, stirring up the water and generating massive waves. Under the right conditions, these waves can reach heights of 20 feet or more, especially with the open expanse of the lake allowing for long fetches of wind. The sheer size and power of the waves can pose serious risks to shipping vessels that cross Lake Superior. The gales of November are a reminder of the sheer power of nature illustrating both the beauty and the danger of Lake Superior. Particularly in the rugged terrain of the Keweenaw Peninsula. These gale storms can also bring heavy snow to the Keweenaw in November. I personally love this time of year the atmosphere is so cozy. It's a time for preparation and anticipation as we transition into the winter season. Okay, Rams. Okay, come on, Boris. Okay, we can't even open the door. Okay, push hard. Oh, look at this. Come on, Boris, you gotta go potty. Come on, go potty. Look at this. In December, the Keweenaw Peninsula transforms into a winter wonderland. The magic of the Keweenaw is further heightened by the phenomenon of lake effect snow. Tree is really creaking. Okay, Rams, look at this porch. Wow. Ready to go in, Rams? The vast and powerful Lake Superior breathes the life into Keweenaw winters. During the winter months, the water of Lake Superior is warmer than the air. As the cold air sweeps across the warm waters of the lake, it gathers moisture, transforming it into lake effect snow. This snow can accumulate rapidly, often resulting in significant snowfall that blankets the Keweenaw white. <laughs> it's pretty deep, hey Rams? Yeah, I tricked them into making me a trail. Yeah, I just got Yeah, you let them follow you, I let them go first. Oh, look at you. <laughs> you got a crusty table. Now it's your cocoa, honey. <laughs> How's your cocoa? It's very good. <laughs> Dog flavored? Not yet. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Go, Ramsey!
December in the Keweenaw is a magical time, where the charm of small town Houghton comes alive under a blanket of snow. The air is crisp and cold with most days below freezing, creating a winter wonderland. The long nights of December are brightened by festive decorations, twinkling lights, and the warmth of local gatherings. Many events are held here at the pier on the waterfront boardwalk in Houghton. This festive event is called Winter Wonderland, where the community comes together to kick off the holidays. Lake Superior is a vital player in shaping the Keweenaw's weather and climate. From the cool breezes that temper the heat in the summer to the heavy snowfall that blankets the landscape in the winter, Lake Superior acts as a dynamic weather engine and is the heartbeat of the Keweenaw Peninsula. If you enjoyed our journey through the seasons, you may just want to check out this next video. See you there!